Hello lovely people, welcome back to my channel, my name is Emma, and or Blaunt, you can call me Blaunt if you like. And we're four star, your girl's got her fourth star. Yeah, thank you very much. Ooh, leaden balls. Intriguing, and hyper potions. I really feel like I need those yet, but that's good. So, we've, ooh, ooh. We've unlocked a whole new area, immediately distracted. Back alley, Mr. Mime. Seems a Mr. Mime has taken up residence in Jubilife. Its eerie movements are making Andra, one of the villagers, a touch nervous. Yeah, well, understandable, because they are extremely creepy. I'm wearing a, um, I'm wearing a Mime Junior mask. Because freaking Mime Junior is so cute. And I feel Mime Junior doesn't deserve to evolve into Mr. Mime. Do you know what though? The um, what is the other form? I've forgotten what the name of it is. Like what area it's from. But the other form of Mr. Mime is a lot cuter. And uh, I've made some new clothes. I've got an Oshawa outfit on, but with a Mime Junior mask. I think I'm looking pretty, pretty fantastic. I still got my uh, my current team. I got Oshawa. I got Pikachu, Psyduck, of course, Baneri, Ponyta. Really want to um, evolve this Ponyta. Um, hey guys, you're. I think I put some berries in here already. Hey, dear dude. It's really nice seeing the. I went really the long way. Um, it's really nice seeing the Pokemon helping people out in the village now. It feels like we've actually made a difference in the game already. <laughs> Hi, Andra. Oh, this is the person we found Orin berries for. I had a wretched time in the Fieldlands, getting harried by Pokemon left and right. You even got me with a few of their moves. I didn't have a chance to use all the orange berries you got me. They made a lovely snack. Great. I suppose you'll hear about my request to the professor. Would you mind investigating the Mr. Mime that's taken up residence here in the village? Just having a wild Pokemon among us is scary enough, and there's the eerie way that it moves. The security corps refused to handle it for whatever reason. I wonder why. It's over there! See what it's up to, would you? Hey, Mr. Mime, what are you doing hiding behind this little little building. Do you wanna... Do you wanna chat to my ponyta? No? Maybe I can approach it from the back? <sighs> Mr. Mime are really awkward because obviously they can put up that, um, that wall, like, shield. Does he know I'm here? Don't think so. Hey buddy, I just want to chat. Sorry if I startled you. Oh, he's gone. Mr. Mime. Um, he ran off that way. Which way? He wouldn't run unless it had something to hide. I could be shy. It is essentially a wild animal. Chase the fleeing Mr. Mime. Where did... Wh which way did it... Which way did it go? Okay, it's all the way over there. I love that he was like, that way, while just looking directly at me. <laughs> he wasn't even pointing. Hello. Where'd he go? Where'd he go, fella? Andrew? Mr. Mime ran right up there. Oh, there he is. Hey, Mr. Mime. Don't be scared, buddy. Oh, it's put an invisible wall up. You scoundrel. You scallywag. Will he see me if I approach from this direction? I don't know where he is. I think he's not popped into existence here, there. No, I can't come from this way at all. He's completely blocked it off. Oh, no, he hasn't. I just got stuck on something weird. Mr. Mime? Oh, I got close. <laughs> hey! Don't run off, please. Please, just talk to me. Please, mime at me. Let me let, help me understand you. You ran off that way. You've got a roundabout way of trying to get up close to Pokemon. Are you secretly scared of them or something? Unless that Mr. Mime is using some kind of mysterious power. Yeah, hello. Oh, of course, I guess they don't know anything about these Pokemon yet. Come on then. God, I wish my character had a bit more stamina. There he is. Hi. 
Go see if it's really making walls. It's definitely making walls. Usually you can see them making the walls, but... It's like a little labyrinth. That is rotating and making walls in different places. He's such a clever little buddy. I do feel a bit bad for Mr. Mimes. They get a raw deal, but, you know. They are also incredibly creepy. Hi. Oh, hey. It's like sometimes he lets me in. <laughs> Don't be scared. Yeah, he's making a wall. What is it, Mr. Mime? Looks like something's got you in a panic. Oh, it helps him guard the gate sometimes. That's cool. It's docile and it helps me with my job, so I just let it do as it pleases. That's why the security core wouldn't help. Oh, good. However, one watches out for invisible obstacles. Oh, look, Mr. Mime's happy now. Okay, thanks, buddy. Cool. Oh, so he's just chilling out there. Hi. Oh, now we can talk to him. He's not putting up a wall before us. Aw, what a good little buddy. Okay, cool. Right, anyway, it's time to go out into a new area. Oh my gosh, this is it. This is it. Crimson Mire Lands. I'm excited. Yes, please. A whole new world. Did I make that joke last time? I might have done. Woo, look, it's all boggy. Oh my gosh, if we find a quagsire here. This looks like where you would find a quagsire. They're my favourite. Here we are, my boy. The Crimson Mirelands. An era teeming with poison-wielding Pokemon and plenty of others besides. I've heard about your mission, Blaunt. If you're looking for the Salacian Ruins, they're off that way. Why can nobody lift their arms in this world? They have to turn their entire bodies to indicate a direction. Oh yeah, that's definitely the ruins. <laughs> that's them. For now, I'll keep searching for those space-time distortions. There's little way of knowing when or where one might appear, but I'll do my best. Huh. Dangerous places where powerful Pokemon appear. Okay. Be mindful of your limitations as well. Go to the training grounds and have Captain Zisu teach your Pokemon some strong moves. Alright. Cool. Thanks, guys. I'm going to get super distracted on my way picking up a million Pokemon, but it is a new area. Hello. Hey there, you're that go-getter from the Survey Corps, right? I'd love to know more about a Pokemon called Roselia. Yeah, it's very pretty. Yeah, of course. No problem. Absolutely no problem. Hi. Yeah, they get surprised and drop their shit. I mean, who wouldn't? Is that a Budgie? Oh my gosh, Budgie. Oh, this is exciting. Oh, this is really exciting. I should have made some more Pokeballs, actually. I'll go back in a second and make some more. Look at this little budgie hanging out at the edge of a little watering hole. Hi. Oh, so cute. Oh, hearty grains. Oh, I need to clear out my inventory. Oh my gosh, okay. Just give me a moment to do some uh, crafting and inventory management. Ponytail, will you go and grab that hearty grain for me? <gasps> Cyduck hanging out in the lake. Cyduck hanging out in a lake. It's a precious watery boy. I love you, Cyduck. Look at it, I'm frolicking around in the water. Oh my god. What's this? This is just a bit of a tree. Okay. Ooh. I don't even know what that is. What is that? What are you? You're very large. It looks like a carnivorous plant. Would you like a heavy ball? Is it going to be mad and attack me? Carnivine! Look at his dopey little face! That's hysterical. Oh my gosh, my Drifloon can evolve. Oh, that was a large specimen. That's what it might be. Oh my gosh, okay. I've, I feel like we should probably evolve our short as well because it's 33 and like, I don't know. I feel like we're never gonna... Oh, here goes the buddy! We're never gonna completely fill up the, um, 
the Pokedex, you know. It's technically complete. Driftblim! Hi, Driftblim. You're so cute. Fuck it, let's do it. Oshawa, your time has come. You're so cute. You're my cute little buddy. I'll always love you with all my heart. Oh! Oh my god, you're so cute! It's Jewart! This little angry mouth is even more adorable than before. Oh my gosh, there's so much going on. Where's my quest marker? Okay, it's that direction. So I probably should vaguely head in the correct direction. Because otherwise I'm going to get super distracted. Hi, Psyduck! Hi, Psyduck! My boy loves a little mushroom cake! He's not going for it. He was surprised, but he's not hes not going for it. He doesn't love a mushroom cake at all. I can't believe it. Well, oh, he's sat down in stress. <laughs> oh my god. I'm really fucking this up in just the most amazing way. Okay. Um. Oh! Ow! He blocked me getting out my Pikachu because he was so pissed off. Alright, Pikachu. Use the old Thundershock. Sorry, Psyduck. I tried to give you a snack. I tried to just get you on my side. I fucked it all up. I really did. I'm aware of that. What's that thing? Oh, the music's gone all funky. Ponytail, what's that? Caster Fern. Oh, good. Apricorns. I need loads. I got, like, no Pokeballs right now. Well, this is cool. Look at this. It's another one of these... Big Chongus is Carnivern? Was it Carnivern? Oh, it's raining now. Hi. Your dopey little face is so wonderful. Yes, it is. Now it's definitely without noticing. Yes. Maybe I'll try and catch this Psyduck as well. Oh. They've not got the best situational awareness, have they? Yeah. Fortunately for them, I am garbage. I am hot garbage. Okay, Psyduck. At least we're enjoying the land of the Psyduck for a while. I can't remember if Pikachu's meant to be using agile or strong moves or anything like that for its Pokedex entry. Oh good, I think we wanted to see to use um hypnosis. Go on, Pikachu! Yes! Yes! Now well, we do need to defeat one more with electric moves, so... A ball of mud! Oh, this one's asleep! Oh, hi! Oh my gosh, you're taking a nap! You're taking a nappy nap! Huh. Wake up, bitch! I'm sorry. I'm sorry I called you. Uh-oh! I should have checked Carnivine's Pokedex entry entry before I before I got it, but oh well. Oh, it's only level 17. All right, blast it, Ponyta. Two stun to move. Okay, do another Agile Ember. We might be able to get it. We might be able to get it. No, we killed it. That's okay. We've got to defeat some as well. So fine. Oh, this is so exciting. It's really hard not to get distracted in a new area full of different Pokemon. Although I'm getting distracted even with the Psyduck, which I've already got quite a lot of. But, oh well. There's another one. Look at that little buddy. They're so cute. I love them. They are precious. Hello. Dodging is everything. Everything. Yeah, I know. I'm not, I'm not great at remembering to dodge, actually. Who's that? Hello? It's a little kid? Or an old woman. I'm Calabra of the Pearl Clan, Warden Calabra to you. Oh, now would you look at that? You have a Celestica flute. You must be the one they say fell out of the space-time rift. That's me. I guess? Hello. I've already heard about you, you quail cleaver and his frenzy. 
I'm sure many people were saved by your actions, but I wonder if there wasn't some other way to handle the situation. I mean, all everything we do is kind of bullying a Pokemon into submission. Okay. She's a bit old and stuck in her ways. Okay. Wow. Um, I want to help. And I've got to prove that I'm useful, otherwise uh, everybody's gonna kick me out. Ah, Blaunt! How about you show me the strength that could quell even a frenzied lord? What, you wanna just fight right now and here? What are you even doing here? <laughs> I mean, okay, but why? Alright, well, I mean... They've only got two Pokemon, so I'm not really... Oh. Oh my god, Togepi. Ready to fight a baby again? Flame wheel it. Get him, Ponyta. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. You just rammed a horse into a little tiny baby's face. Come on, ball. Oh my gosh, look at you. I've never seen you before, you're wonderful. Oh, Ponyta. <gasps> Ponyta! We're gonna have to revive you if we want to get any XP for this. Um... Baneary? Yeah, why not? It's Baneary's time to shine. We've not been using Baneary much. I tend to kind of hyper-focus on one Pokémon. Uh, so I can level it up. Ooh, we're running a bit. We need to actually get more Vivichokes, because we're running low on revives now. Look at it, it's so cute! Why do I relate so much to this little Pokemon? Alright, Draining Kiss. Um, use an Agile one so we can sneak in there first. Mwah! Oh, Baneary, you're such a cutie. You're such a little charmer, aren't you? Damn, dude, chill out. One more Agile Draining Kiss. I think we're supposed to use more baby doll eyes as well to get the um, Pokedex entry for Baneary, but I'm not great at using moves that aren't attack moves. <laughs> You're quite adept at instructing your Pokemon in battle. My goodness, that was fun. It was fun. Had a good time. Such prodigious strength. Let me heal up your Pokemon. Thank you very much. Okay, good chat. I must ask for your help in retrieving the stolen wall fragment. I mean that gap in the middle. Some bandits pis pillaged this. Oh my gosh, pillaged the Salacion ruins and made off with a fragment of the wall engravings. There are a trio of bandits that have even hit us Ginkgo Guild merchants more than a few times. Gosh. Mistress Calabra is doing everything she can to re regain the fragment, but at 99 years old, she's looking terrific for 99. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, look at the size of that bee barrel. She could ride it around. Yeah, of course. They swipe my wares too. Oh no. Yeah, of course I'll help. I did see the remains of a campfire near the Myerlands camp. Perhaps worth checking out? Hmm, okay. Is he coming with me? Is he gonna stay there? He's staying there. Okay, cool. Track down the bandits. Okay, neat. Exciting. I reckon this would be a heavy buddy. Huh! There's a Paris. No, that's a Craddy. No, it's a Paris. <laughs> I got overexcited and my eyesight isn't very good. Nobody here but us chickens. Oh, it's turning to nighttime. We'll get even more different Pokemon. Did he see us? Oh, so he got all scared and ran around. Oh, defeat with flying type moves. I mean, fire type moves. Or did it say flying? Where? Which bit of that did my brain get wrong? I, I thought it said fire, but let's let's see. Go on, Ponyta. Oh, some more grit dust. Cool. Mushroom. I don't have space. 
I need to do a proper sort out of my inventory. Maybe even buy some more spaces from the guy who's charging a fortune now to expand my inventory. Okay, we've got a campfire. Clearly people were here. Now who might you be? Not some stray traveller from the look of you. Oh shit, that's them! You're after us three, aren't you? Sisters, we should introduce ourselves properly before we show this poor fool how wrong he was to assume he could ever beat us. Big talk. Um, I came out of the sky. Charm. I'm the eldest and I'll be your unlucky charm. Clover. Okay. Middle sister. Coin. Okay. Those are very unusual names. Except Clover. Clover seems, uh... It seems quite normal. The Misfortune Sisters. Come on, Toxic Rogue. Oh, Toxic Rogue! Love your hair. Oh my gosh, Toxic Rogue! Let's be honest, I prefer Krogan because it's more froggy, but this is okay. Okay, we are actually a bad Pokemon for this, right? For poison? I know, we're kind of okay. Maybe try flame wheeling it, just see what happens. Ponytar looks so small! I think our red ponytar is actually a bit tiny. Oh! Get him! Sorry, Toxic Pro. Did Coin only have one Pokemon? Okay. Oh, couple of level ups. Take the blasted fragment and go, just leave us alone. That was very easy. <laughs> Yay, wall fragment. Now the old lady's probably gonna be nicer to us. The weird writing on it made us think the stupid thing was some kind of treasure. It turned out to be a worthless slab of junk. Really? Uh, oh, I have to pick who I wanted to help. I don't know, I just wanted to help everyone. I just wanna, I just wanna help. Okay. Remember what those ancient verses tell us. Why is it in days of spring, beneath the soft caress of the sun, the blossoms tremble and fall, spirits lashed by uncertainty? Your days are also numbered, galaxy fool. I don't know what that meant. That was some kind of mumbo jumbo to me, I'll be honest. Okay, well great. That was way easier than I expected it to be. Everyone calm down, okay? Just moving on my way. Oh look at how happy the Psyduck look when they frolic around. It's so cute. Hi Psyduck. I love you. I'm not ignoring you. I do want this actually. No he doesn't care. He's like, huh? Uh, hi. I'm never gonna get a ghastly just out of nowhere. I bet it disappears with the daybreak before I can even get the chance. Oh my gosh, Psyduck, what are you doing? You're just following me around like a little buddy? That's adorable, but... Yes! Ghastly! Ah! Oh my god, I've got a Ghastly. This Psyduck is seriously, like, trailing me. It's so cute! Do you want to be my buddy? Is that it? I think, it, I think that Psyduck really wanted to be my buddy. Is this Ghastly asleep? No. <laughs> the answer is no. <laughs> Not asleep. Got it though. Do you think I can get this one before uh, before daybreak? Oh, he's just turned around. Oh, come on. Slow down, buddy. Ah, nuts. Uh, defeat with ghost type moves. Have I still got... Drift Blim. Come on, Drift Blim. We've got some ghost type moves, right? Yeah, we've got Astonish and Hex. Do it! Astonish is so stupid. <laughs> Way! Good job, Drift Blim. Drift Blim. Oh no. There it is. Oh no! I thought that was its daytime disappearance, but. No. Hey! Hey! 
do an Agile Astonish. I don't know how you do Astonish as an Agile move, but we might be able to catch it. You okay, buddy? You okay, Drifflin? Yeah, get it. Yeah, you look menacing while I throw the Pokeball. It's bound to help. Woo! Another Ghastly for the Ghastly collection. I do love Ghastly. I like Haunter a lot. Let's see if we can make this old lady like us a bit more by giving her the bleed a missing thing. It took me like five minutes. You've got to be a bit impressed. At least your bee barrel's got to be impressed. Thank you. Yeah, she's great. I'm sure she's great. Yeah, I mean, yeah, raging Pokemon aren't great for... Not great for anyone, really. Hi, Kavala. Um, I got you the fragment. God, it's massive, isn't it? How am I carrying this around? You've come to bother me again? Well, come as often as you like, but it won't change my mind. What? You went and retrieved the fragment from those bandits? Why go out of your way like that for a complete stranger like me? Guess you're that eager to calm Ursula, Ursula Luna, hmm? Um, if possible, yeah. I'll admit, I didn't expect anybody else to truly care for Ursula Luna. Well then, let's see that war fragment. There it is. There we go, good as new. Uh, all lives... Uh, t... t Oh, it's really hard to make this out. Something other lives to create. Something lives to create. A new and alive. Oh, she's reading it for me. <laughs> I, I feel like I did okay at that. All lives touch other lives to create something a new and alive. I suppose it means people helping each other, like how you helped retrieve the fragment. This is the first time I truly understand what it means. What is your name then, boy? I am Blaunt. Please lend me your strength so that we may help Ursaluna. It's true that Ursaluna has become enraged, but he doesn't seem to be in an utter frenzy. I think he will return to his normal state if we can just give him some medicine. I could never bring myself to engage Pokemon in battle, but that's something I can rely on you for, am I right? Heck yeah! Ursaluna prefers to stay on Sludge Mound. Please join me there when you're ready. Oh, Sludge Mound sounds lovely. I'll meet you there.